One of the most notable quotes of Mahatma Gandhi states, There is enough on this planet for everyone's needs, but not enough for everyone's greed. In India, which is poised to become the fifth largest economy with the youngest and largest workforce in the world, has a whooping 40% of its children from economically challenged families who are severely malnourished. This is a story of how one organization from a region often missed on the Indian map is leading a movement that is now nourishing the nation through nutrition. Many children would faint of hunger and some simply dropped out of school because they were too weak from malnutrition. These children had access to free education and free midday lunch that the schools provided. But still, there was a key ingredient missing. Scientific studies have repeatedly shown that eating a meal first thing in the morning has a positive influence on cognitive performance in school. Considering the need to cover this nutrition gap, in July 2012, a small group of men and women started a unique breakfast program at a rural school in South Bangalore for children coming from impoverished families who otherwise go to school hungry as they had no access to the most important meal of the day, the breakfast. Gradually, more schools appeared on the scene that needed to be served and a trust was formed in 2015 in Muddinahalli in Karnataka state called the Sri Satyasai Annapurna Trust and the project was named Annapurna Breakfast Program. The trust has realized that in order to have the maximum positive impact, an engaged leadership from all sectors of society is required. This is where its collaboration with local vegetable vendors, local governing bodies and authorities have proven successful in bringing a sense of responsibility among communities to come forward in raising their children and build a better future for them. Its motto is, let no child go to school hungry ever and works with a steadfast mission to feed nutritious, well-balanced breakfast every single day to all school-going children from poor families. After studying the nutrition gap in the children, our in-house experts came up with a wholesome mix of health drink that could help bridge it. Sai Shur, a ubiquitous recipe of nutrient-rich ingredients, was conceived and prepped for mass manufacture. Rich in iron, protein, vitamins and carbohydrates, it has all the elements that are much needed for children's growth. What's more, it beautifully complements the Shira Bhagya program run by the state of Karnataka, allowing us to mix Sai Shur and state-sponsored milk or milk powder in hot water and serve the children a glass full of nutrition. Encouraged by the pilot study and clinical trials, Annapurna is now in talks with the government of Puducherry for a similar rollout. The Annapurna Breakfast Program project has become a platform for more than 500 volunteers to serve in addition to the thousands of teachers at the schools. This breakfast program works closely with over 1,000 local vendors in a decentralized model for a seamless execution. Supporting this initiative are many like-minded institutional partners and government workers. MOUs have been signed up with the government of Karnataka, Andhra Pradesh, Telangana, Kerala and Puducherry. Until date, nutritious breakfast is served every day free of cost to over 200,000 school-going children at 2,600 plus centers located across 15 states and two union territories. When every needy child's hunger is eradicated, when its health is fortified with nutrition, a nation too will be fortified in more ways than one.